But first, as we were teasing, or not so subtly teasing, we're making a lot of noise today. Gino Tiozzo is also making a lot of noise, but we would love when he's here from Donatello's, of course, to make another delicious meal for us. How you been? I've been great. Thank you. Yeah. And you? Thank you for having me back on the show. We always love when you're here. How have you been? I've been excellent. Business yeah. has been great. The restaurant's been a lot of fun. We have our, we had our carnival in uh, February, opera night in March. Yeah. Uh, live entertainment in the lounge. Uh, uh, every weekend's just been a lot of fun. All different entertainers. You're taking a break from opera, not, uh, opera night this month, but it will be back in May, right? Correct. In May 17th, we'll have the uh, Opera Tampa okay. singers back again. That's just a great night. It's a lot of fun. Yeah, I hear it's yeah. spectacular. And so is Carnival, and I think we might even do a fall Carnival this year, oh, maybe really? in September. Yeah. It's now, not how do really you do orth that? Because the theme, obviously... <laughs> not quite orthodox, but people have a lot of fun. It's a great night, so, you know, maybe we'll call it something else, but we'll do something along the same lines. Okay. Yeah, Sounds we have good. a lot of different entertainers that come in, and it's just, it's fun. Yeah. It's, a, it's dinner and entertainment. So today I'm making for you a gorgonzola sauce, which I'm going to do with a little piece of chicken and uh, also with veal. We serve it with veal in the restaurant, but I know you ladies, know. you know. I know, we're picky here. I'm different. sorry. So we'll Calling do it with the chicken out, breast Gino. so you can try it also. <laughs> but uh, veal is kind of our... One of our specialties, yeah, so it is. I have it's to your thing. show it the way we do it. Yes, uh, so we're gonna start with a little brandy in the pan. Mm. It's a gorgonzola cream sauce. Mm. Perfect. Now, Matthew, we have to tell our chefs to get the pan hot. I but know. You can tell Gino's a pro and knows our uh, knows our stove. Pan's hot right already. So, a little bit of brandy. You can smell it. Can you see why I was worried when we started the show about starting so close to Gino with as much hairspray as I have? <laughs> that thought didn't cross my mind before right? we were in our makeup little area that we have here oh. in the studio. Okay, like, so we've made a good mess. <laughs> Take care of us, though. And I'm hiding. But from I wanted you. to make sure the pan was hot, and I think we got that. <laughs> Mission accomplished, my friend. <laughs> um, so we've got uh, just a little brandy and some veal stock to start. We'll let that go down a little bit and reduce a little. And now I'm going to put some veal in, just lightly dusted with flour and, and a little bit of veal salt. Force before. Is it always pounded that thin? Is that the kind of the secret to or how it's most likely prepared with uh, veal? Yeah, with scallopina for yeah. sure. But, you know, there's veal chops and different cuts that are prepared differently. That's this like just, super thin. Well, it, we only have a few minutes. Okay, there yeah. you go. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, all right. That makes sense, though. So it's kind of what works well in this, uh, in this setting. Okay. So, Gino, I'm curious. You say that veal's kind of your thing at Donatello's. Why is that? What is it about veal that you do see so much of at Donatello's? Well, we use, first of all, we use an excellent quality of veal. A lot of traditional Italian dishes are veal dishes. Uh, so, we our specialty. Mm -hmm. You know, we have a great, we do a lot of things well. Our pasta dishes are phenomenal and uh, also we have a great seafood selection. So, here I just added some heavy cream. I'm going to put a little more. A little more, a little more. Yeah, a little cream is good. What I've also and learned from you, too, like in Italy and the different parts of Italy and what they're used to, you know, there's some areas that are more seafood, others more veal, where you guys really... Correct. Now, our... I'm just going to put these yeah, over here. Ahead. Don't get nervous. It's cooked already. I'm not worried. <laughs> <laughs> but the... Um, yeah, the, we're originally from Venice, which is a lot of seafood, but in the restaurant we have a huge menu, a lot yeah. of variety. We have some great fillets. Uh, you know, we, we have to give a good variety. We like to... It's American-Italian. Well, not exactly. <laughs> we try to keep it as traditional as possible, but... Again, as a, we're but picky. Also, you need to make sure that you have something for everybody. Correct. I remember when I was pregnant, like Carly, you brought in some awesome uh, pasta dishes for me. That was one of my cravings. I did. Can I uh, request some pasta, <laughs> even though I'm not the pregnant one? I'll do one for you next time I Deal. come, I promise. Okay? What was that? Carbon I like request. Well, carbonara. That's my go-to. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm going to make for you good. next time I come in is a pappardelle with a also buco with a, with a, with a meat. Yeah. Yeah, it's excellent. Okay. You know, so, Jordan behind the camera over here. He's our resident chef he's uh, like, in yes, studio. He's like, yes, yes. yes. So now we're going to add the main ingredient here, which is a nice spicy gorgonzola. That's going to give it... We've got a minute it, left. We know a minute? We to okay, we're in. done. Yeah. I got it. A little more gorgonzola. That just needs a second to melt. Down. Perfect. Right. Some asparagus. Oh, look at that. Oh, beautiful. Chopped up. 
We should mention some diced tomato. Too, I know this is a big month for going out to eat for Easter, but you guys are going to be closed on that Sunday, correct? But we open. are closed Easter Sunday. Okay. But we have a big night Saturday, Saturday night that's before. Saturday, even if family's in town, you can of still course. celebrate. Okay, so let's get this uh, going for you, okay. so you can try it. We have 30 seconds, Gina. 30 seconds. You know what 30 seconds is yeah. enough for, though? Enough to grab the wine. <laughs> we forgot about that part, Gino. <laughs> Go for Carly. it. Carly, you can't have any, but you can toast you with us. You did pour me one just so I, I can toast, so I'm not I'm not so left okay. out. <laughs> Cheers. Thank you so much. Thanks for coming in. We appreciate it, and uh, we know. Do you need reservations this time of year, you think? Uh, on weekends especially, right but, there. you know, if you decide to come in at the last minute, we never say no. There yeah. you go. Just ask for Gino. He'll take care of you. Yeah. Say you watch him on the morning blend. Look at that dish. Gino, as always, we do love when you are here. Thank All right. You. Well, up next, as the 